PopCon, the annual convention dedicated to pop culture, is happening at the convention center. News 8's Amisha Ramsey is there to tell us what's ahead when you go down there this uh, weekend. Amisha, hi. <laughs> Hey, Scott. Good morning. Uh, my inner child is coming out of me. Um, I want to show you all just this Pikachu collector's card here. It's a large Pokemon card. Um, I'm going to have to challenge Scott to a duel later on, and I'm going to bust out this card when I get back. So he better be prepared. But it's really exciting here at PopCon. Anything that you can imagine. I mean, things from your youth, things that are happening now from anime to cartoons, some of your favorite movies like Star Wars, you can find it all here. I'm going to have Will just kind of pan here. We'll also see Carl, who is the man in charge for this event today. Carl is the COO of this event. It's locally based. Um, you guys have done this for the past nine years. Congratulations. You. And you've also managed to get through an entire pandemic. And you were one of the first uh, events to start back up last year. How does it feel to be able to start up this year? Oh, well, we absolutely love Indianapolis. So, you know, we're from here. We want to make sure that we, we bring a lot of it, it's we're a national event. Yeah. So we bring people in from I think we've got 30 states worth of people coming in for the event yeah. this weekend. But it's made for the people that are listening right now. Now. Yeah. We need you to come out. That's what it's for. We need you guys to come out. Uh, the doors open at nine. I mean, excuse me, one o'clock. But what you see right now, some of the vendors haven't quite set up everything already. So you're getting a behind the scenes, really exclusive look. I want to show you this guy really quickly. Doesn't he kind of look like someone who who, who wrestles like a, maybe to a, 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 the rock Dwayne Johnson? I was looking at that earlier and he kind of looks like that. What do you think, Carl? Well, yeah, absolutely. And they even named it the boulder. So that's exactly <laughs> what they're going for. So let's talk about some of the vendors. We see that there are a lot of different people who are bringing different uh, items out. More than 370 vendors are here. That, that's pretty close, yes. So um, we've got tons of art mm -hmm. and uh, toys and collectibles, uh, virtual reality, mm -hmm. uh, Lego. Yeah. There, there's uh, everything you can think of will be here. Everything geek. Everything geek. Everything. And I'd be remiss, you guys, to not let you guys mention this, but it is Pride Month. It, ha it started three days ago, and PopCon is in is partnering with this month's celebration. If you take a look at Carl's shirt, it's inspired for Pride Month. What are some of the things that people can come out? and expect for today well absolutely so yes we partnered with indie pride which we we're really happy to do and uh we they have announced tonight as uh indie pride night yeah. at popcon uh we have several panels and discussions and even a comedian yes. over the course of the weekend tonight we have a drag race competition where people of their choice mm -hmm. will get to go up on stage and actually compete and lip sync for their lives and it's going to be a great time tonight oh i love a good drag show I, I might have to come out myself and and bring out my sasha fierce so maybe Maybe, maybe we can do that. Um, so you guys, stick around. We'll have another uh, interview with Carl. He's been great. He's going to talk a little bit more about the vendors, and we'll see a little bit more about costumes and cosplay. If you guys don't know what that is, we'll have all that information for you. But for now, we'll send it back to the CEO reporting live here at PopCon. <laughs>